Fight Live returns to Channel 5 this Friday. Two of Britain's most exciting super lightweights collide at London's legendary York Hall. Don't miss Eubank vs Farrell this Friday on Channel 5. I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. Let's see if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, completely different ball game. I'll walk away from me and this has been like a therapy session. Uh, I'm joking. You look all right. I would say five out of ten, but five out of ten, but a ten out of ten. <laughs> Boom. So that's all right. <laughs> right, we good? Oscar Bevis, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. The smile says it all. Martin Foro. Um, yeah, you couldn't really have asked for much more when you woke up this morning, could you? No, that was it, really. Yeah, I could have asked for uh, for being the main event, but <laughs> no, of course. Now, now you're pushing it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'm feeling good, man. Wonderful. Woke up feeling good as well. Had a little breakfast, chilled, watched some boxing. I like watching uh, Muhammad Ali or uh, Roy Jones Jr. And then, uh, you know, it gets me pumped, gets me ready. That's yeah. so interesting because I know a lot of fighters who kind of just, they're in their own zone yeah. and they don't even think about boxing until they step in the ring. But you're waking up and you're watching your idols to get you, to get you pumped for your day. Yeah, well, well so I always watch boxing and, but like to, to, to learn the, the crowd, like learn my skills and stuff, I watch diff all different boxes. But then when I actually, when it comes to fight night, I like to watch Roy Jones, but I like to watch Muhammad Ali, because I, rela I relate with them the most. You know, the way their, their character and their, the way they talk, the way they box, I love it so much. Well, they both done a right in the sport, so I think, <laughs> yeah. you're, I think you're heading in the right direction watching them. Um, about the in-ring stuff, good again from you tonight, and got the stoppage. Um, just kind of an assessment of your own performance, perhaps away from the stoppage as well, and how you yeah. box okay, you wasn't in there for too long, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I started off, um, wanting too much i think you know but i really wanted to I, straight away i want to show everything you know what i'm trying to say and then i'm too eager and i'm coming in like I, may, I might be walking on i can i can be walking onto shots not heavily not crazy but still like, i know i could have been more professional you know what i'm saying and then second round i came out more professional using my jab more um calculating my distance better and then eventually getting to stop him yeah. It's a bit of a double-edged sword in that sense because I suppose you said that as if that was a thing that you could have done better. But being eager to improve is never a bad thing. And the fact that you're just so eager to impress and impress, because I know where you want to be and it's not yeah. fighting now, it's fighting in a couple of hours' time and on TV. I know, I so know. It's, I suppose it's not a bad thing in a sense, just wanting to impress that much. True, it's, you're right, you're right. But you, it's like, I feel like I'm always, like, always battling time. You know what I'm trying to say? I want to do it now, 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 now. You know, and then... But you're right though, I should take my time more and I should enjoy, I do enjoy being in there. What the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> I'm waffling, mate. <laughs> so yeah, been, I love it, man. Since I've seen yeah. you for about the last two minutes, you've had nothing but a smile on your face. Yeah, man. What, you should have seen me before though. <laughs> no, I swear to God, bro, like I smile all my way, like from the, the moment I wake up to the moment I get in the ring and out of the ring and after. I'm always smiling, man, because this is really what I love the most. I love this so much. I enjoy it. I enjoy being in there. I love performing, as you see as well. Like when I when I walk to the ring, I'm performing. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm smiling to everyone. I'm like, yeah, it's me again. <laughs> you know? So yeah, man. That's why. You are, I can tell, and I've noticed this from speaking to you before. You're aware that boxing is more about than what goes on in the ring. There's more to it than that. Of course, man. You've got to be a character. You've got to be able to put on a show, and and also the fans must must be able to connect um, connect with you as well. Is it like I'm, I'm a human as well. Like, I, like same way someone else can enjoy some, some doing something they love. I'm enjoying this because I love this, and they they can really see when they look at me. From the moment they see me walk out to the moment I finish, they know right. He, he's really enjoying this. We enjoyed it. Just one more thing. I, I know Daly said it. I think I heard yeah, over there. Um, actually, I'll bring him in for this. If I can bring you in just quickly, I heard you say this over there, and it was that. Um, if you want to be fighting on main events and fighting on TV, that's the sort of performances you've got to put in. I mean, I don't sugarcoat anything, you know. Um, obviously, we want to box with intelligence. You know, we want to display our craft in the right way. But at the end of the day, it's the entertainment business as well. And if you want to get on those big shows, on those TV platforms, and if you want the fan base and the fans to keep coming back, then you need finishes like that. There's a reason why everyone, Javante Davis, people like that, fill up, fill up an arena, you know? Um, there might be, he, like Ryan Garcia's got a bigger audience on social media, but who puts, the bum, uh, who puts the bums on the seats? Javante Davis, he sells out arenas, so. It's about having that balance, 
you know, intelligence, showing your craft in the right way. But if the opportunity is there to take someone out, you take someone out. We were intelligent tonight. Superb. Bailey, Martin. Yes. Thank you Super so much. Superb. Fight Live returns to Channel 5 this Friday. Two of Britain's most exciting super lightweights collide at London's legendary York Hall. Don't miss Eubank vs Farrell this Friday on Channel 5. I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. You see if someone grabbed up my wife and saying, completely different ball game. I'll walk away from here and this has been like a therapy session.